Hello everybody, today we're going to be playing The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. This is an official uh, game by Sega. It was released on April Fool, so I'm very late to this. Um, I just wanted to play it, check it out, because I haven't yet. Uh, it's been on Steam for the longest time, I've yet to get it. No assist, but what if it? What if what? <laughs> All right, new game. Let's check. It's free. It's a free Sonic game. What's going on? Phew, made it on the train. 15 minutes ahead of schedule. So far, so good. For my first day on the job. Oh, I totally forgot my name tag. Is it ready yet? I should make. What? Well, I should make one. I'll just have a name here. Oh, all right. Um. Zell, let's go with that. That's my name. Look at that horrible handwriting. Zell, did I spell that right? Yes. Hope passengers can read my scribble. Is that me? I guess that's me. Cool. Ooh. Dining car. Na 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 Uh oh, I am nervous. This is this is the first day on the job. Working the train's dining dining car can't be so bad. Come on. Zell shake it off. He wants he's trying to shake it off. He's trying to get himself together. Jesus! Did I just see you hitting yourself? M Mr. Conductor, sir, how, how are you doing this morning? Oh, oh, oh. quite alright myself. No feeling. A little bit of sweet. Uh, ew, what? No! Well, truth be told, not really. Last day is my last day as conductor. I'm tired of 32 wonderful years. Are they wonderful, sir? Are they- you're not looking like a happy person. I bet you killed Sonic. Time for me and the Mer Marriage Express to say goodbye to one another. Oh, congratulations on retirement, sir. I need my water. This is- this is gonna cry some reading. I need a good throat for this. Ah, alright. Thank you. My wife is very excited about it. She's already got our plane tickets to Sput Gania unlocked. Our shower's been on the fritz, so I'm excited to use the hotel's. Bah ha ha! Oh, so escape is that? I can see why my wife's excited. Enough of my quibbles today. Your first day working. The diner car. Here's the menu for today. Menu added to your inventory. Well, look at that. I can open my inventory anytime to view items I've received. I should look over at the menu carefully. Okay. Menu. Search. Chili dog. Ramen. Chicken. Cordon blue. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Bah! Though I am sure a little quiz is in order, which of these do we serve in our dining car? This thing. Ding ding ding! Glad you could read the menu, okay? Ha ha ha! A little about the vessel. This is a state of the art speed smart train with the latest gadgets. The train can really handle anything you throw at it. We've had a lot of adventures together, me and this train. It's not easy to leave. After 32 years, I don't blame you for being wistful. This train is exclusively used for events. It's not a passenger train. I remember that from the interview. What's the event today? Murder mystery party! Nothing better than some thrills to end my ten tenure as conductor. I can't read. 
guest will be funneled here to the dining car as a home base, so to speak. I'll be with you to gather tickets, but after that, you'll be on your own. So I'll need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are well taken care of, understood? I can't afford to lose this job, sir. You can't, you sure can't. The servant's pay is lousy. <laughs> Doors to Murray's Express are opening on the board. Let's go. Knuckle. Oh, I like the art style of this game. Tails! He's, he's fancy! My boy! Wow! Wow! He's shit. How did Tails talk in Sonic X? That's my question. How did Tails talk in Sonic X? It's like his worst. I can, al I can always give Tails the uh, congested voice from Sonic, uh, Sonic Adventure. Okay. I'm just gonna do some. Wow, they... what do you talk like? Wow, this train is incredible. What a fascinating tech. Hey, Vec, when's the last time he's been seen? He, he's a loudmouth, right? You're right, Tails. <laughs> I can get used to staying on a train like this. Stop with girls. Okay. Wait, no. No. <laughs> what what did you all expect? You know I always go all out for my birthday party. Oh my god, why? Why characters who haven't been seen in a while? I was just playing Sonic Adventure 2, I should know this. This tra This train, as elegant as you are, Amy, I promise I won't take anything now. Stop! What? He's got his cowboy hat from the one movie. Yeah. Uh, calm down there, Rouge. Did I not just catch you stealing from the train station gift shop? It was a pen, knucklehead. Who's gonna miss a tiny, a teeny tiny pen? I, I hate everything. What cast of characters am I stuck with? The best ones, alright? Get a hold of yourself, Zoe. You're sweating the uniform. Yes, sir! Sonic! Hey, pal! Can I get one of those chili dogs? Radio friend! Who well, aren't you friendly? Why can't it be normal for one second? Why? Why? Alright. I'm gonna calm down there. I'm gonna calm down just a bit there. Let's turn that music down a bit. You know, maybe that'll be- Ah! Okay. Whatever. Alright. Why can't I be normal for one second? Sonic, wait until I announce everyone's roles to get food. Haha! <laughs> Sorry about that birthday, girl. So, so, I said that all in one sentence of first offs. I'll be coming around to collect everyone's tickets. Please have them. <coughs> I feel like he's the... I feel like he's the... I, I feel like we shouldn't like him. I feel like we shouldn't trust this man. You'll join me, Zell, won't you? Just click on whoever you like to talk to, like to talk with, and I will contact their ticket. Okay, I got it. <gasps> My boy! I'll where's Silver? My boy, what are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? Here. Marriage Express. Thank you, everything is in order. He seems concerned about something. What are you concerned about? Is there anything we can help you with? Do you sell gift bags here? Uh, uh, no, sadly, but I have a plastic grocery bag in the back. I could get for you. That stare, uh, so, so cold. So you're shivering. Do you need me to fetch your check? Good character. Uh, where's like Tangle? Where's Silver? Knuckles, what are you doing over there? Uh. Uh. Who else? Where's Charmy? You two are here. Where's Charmy? Uh, Espio. Why? Oh. Uh, 
could we please see your ticket? Of course. Excellent. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy your stay with us. Absolutely, I appreciate it. There's a calmness about him, something about his presence puts me at ease. It's Espio. Yeah, you should. You considering me calming? Yes. Yes, we are. He's looking right at me. He's like a prince. Why are you coming here dressed like a prince? You gonna save Amy or something? I study. <laughs> I study the jutsu. I believe what can you indicate through the subconsciousness. Believe it. Oh, wow, ninjutsu, that sounds like a lot of difficult training. Can you cling onto walls? Cling onto walls? What kind of question is that? I most certainly can. Yeah, he's a chameleon, first of all. But Ninjutsu looks a bit too smug at that answer. Ah, jeez, don't trust him. Vector, I like you. Why are you dressed like a carpenter? How are you already dirty? Look at all that. Okay. Hello, my friend. Can I get your ticket? Oh, yeah, sure, of course. As a gentleman of understanding morals, I'd love to show you my ticket. I gotta play Undertale for you all. I love doing that game because I love doing the voices. Um, he seems to be avoiding eye contact. Yeah, he's he's him. Okay, don't mess with Vector. He's something amiss, sir. There's something amiss, sir. I seem to have uh, misplaced my ticket. Could you speak up a bit? I couldn't quite hear. I misplaced my ticket! I don't know where it is! He's not hiding his embarrassment very well. No, he's not! Don't worry, we'll take a look around for you and see if it turns up. Ah! That'll be amazing! Thanks a million! Seems as though we should keep our eyes peeled for the ticket. Yeah, that seems like him. So these three are done. I can talk to this thing! Mmm, yummy. Don't mind if I do. Zell, those are for our guests, you know! Train, be sure Zell only gets one of those if they ask. Beep boop! Beep boop! Did the arm just kinda nod? Actually, uh, Train, the conductor wants me to have the whole plate. Hey! Ah, good try, young buck! The train and I have worked together a long time. You'll have to work harder than that to get what you want. Dread! There's tags around the next day. Alright. Oh, and a nice looking fella. Oh. I can talk to the tissues! What's sticking out of the napkin holder? There's his ticket! So, was this something about a ticket earlier? Let's just return this to its rightful owner. And let's make sure no one uses the ticket as a napkin. Alright, I'll, I'll come back to him later. Let's talk to these three. Knuckles! Howdy, could I be... How, howdy, could I please get your tickets? I think that's a ticket. But I really don't want to argue with this guy. Everything looks good. Thank you. He's not gonna talk? Seems like he doesn't want to argue either. <laughs> okay, he. You look so happy here. But everywhere else. Shadow! I don't wanna know what's going on with you. Cause you're just. Normally, you'd be trying to challenge him, talk to Rouge, or make fun of Vector. This is very out of character for you. Uh. Welcome to board the Marriage Express. Are there any like random objects we can interact with? I, the tissue box, this thing. Uh, anything else? I don't think so. Tails, my best friend. Let's go. Hey, buddy. Can I get your ticket, youngin? Isn't he like eight or nine or something like that? Right here, sir. Thank you. May I offer you snacks we have on board? No, thank you. When I travel, I expect my own sparkle gelatin. <laughs> it's a sparkly jelly that could melt any jaded heart. He 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 is an eight-year-old, I'm pretty sure. No way! No way! I brought my own sparkle gelatin with me too. It's my first day. I was a little nervous. 
stuff. You never see the guys so far. That's fine. Go tell the buddies. I he's he's my best friend already. Ha! <laughs> Absolutely. If you need anything, just let us know. Thank God, is someone on the church normal? I don't think we're normal. Um. Hmm. I don't want to talk to him. There's just something about him that screams, "Don't talk to me." But I talked to the shady dude in the back. What up, Shadow? Hmm. <laughs> sure these three. All right. Uh, where? Okay. I, I was gonna click on whichever one I landed on. Amp up. Well, Blaze. May I have your ticket, please? Thank you very much. On top of it, I see a princess such as myself must always be. Punctual. Oh, wait, that's Blaze talking. A princess like myself must always be punctual. Princess? She's a, yeah, she's a princess from a different world. If you don't mind me asking, are you visiting from somewhere? A separate dimension, actually. A separate what? Just here for Amy's birthday, and I'll hop back to my own dimension. I quite prefer the birthday cake from this world more than any of my own, so I admit, I'm a bit excited. Ho oh. ho. Ho ho, if you don't say. Well, I hope you enjoy your stay, princess. Should I bow? Do I bow before a princess? What are you doing? Please get up. Why can I not win with this group? With, I mean, you and Tails are now gelatin buddies, so. Alright. Bonk, bonk. And, okay. Bonk. There we go. Could I please get the birthday girl's tickets? Hee hee, why certainly. Thank you, miss, and thank you for choosing our fine train for your birthday festivities. Well, the birthday discount certainly helped. Who doesn't love a good bargain? And a murder mystery train just sounds so exciting. It's right up my alley. Who doesn't love a good thrill? You see, I'm a girl who loves a good true crime podcast. Maybe we should leave her to have one. Before we move along for you, miss. Oh, have fun. Thank you. Where, is, where do I use this? That unlocks any door on the train. Happy birthday. The birthday girl gets the birthday key. It's practically a tradition. Very useful. Will I use the wi this wisely? Thank you. All right. Uh, I'm going to give Vector back his thing. <laughs> yeah, we found it. Screw you. What's this? Where is my ticket? They got it on the boat! They got it on the boat! You're missing! Okay. I, I'm tired of reading. My throat is already done. I need more liquid water. <laughs> ah! I knew I'd just be doing a lot of talking, so I got a heavy stack of water. I'm talking to you last because I don't like the way you look. Bruce, what's up? Well, hello, you two. What can I do for you? Oh, wait, no, that's for talking. Okay. Good morning, ma'am. Can we get your ticket? My, my, how far away? Let me fetch it for you. Merge Express. Come back if you need anything else. Come back if you need anything else. You hear? Well, she's so polite. Very easy to talk to as well. No, ma'am, I saw you uh, sneak that $20 bill out of my pocket. I'm gonna have to kindly ask for that back. <laughs> Oh, this was yours? Plus, it just slipped out. Here you go. I may not actually be the best at judging characters. Alright. I don't like you. Ticket, please. Thank you. Oh, no. Thank you kindly. Happy to have someone as renowned as yourself aboard. Huh? Don't worry about it. I just like helping. When Eggman took over, I truly feared the worst. My kid swore you would swoop in eventually. And you did. This looks like they're in the comic book styles, so maybe it's in the IDW comics where the metal virus just happened. I I read the books. They're actually some of the best comics that have come out in twenty in in recent time. Don't sweat a thing, or just sweat a thing. I'm glad you are. You and your family are safe. Wait a second. Is he is he Sonic the Hedgehog? No, this is another random blue hedgehog. With long spikes, green eyes, one big eye, was always having a smirk, always dressed in weird costumes, big gloves, big sneakers with buckles on them. Wait. 
I promise you an excellent stay on our train, Sonic. Have fun. Y yes, you have fun. Come on now. We'll do thanks. Okay, everyone. Time for me to read out Spongebob's for the Man of Mystery. Not happy he looks scary. And that's my cue to leave. I must prepare for the driver's compartment and departure. Yeah, go. Shoot, 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 shoot. Ah, the conductor's car. You remember our promise, yeah? You'll do everything in power to make sure our guests have a safe and enjoyable time on the Murder's Express. Absolutely. You down on me? To be, to be honest, this group seems plenty capable on their own. You sure about that? I'm not quite sure about that. I am not quite sure about that, dude. I'm, I'm really not. I'm really not. I'm really not sure about that, man. You might want to have some of your stuff checked, dude. Boom, 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 boom. So is of any. Oh, really? Ah. Nothing more heartwarming than a conductor in his train. Select Albio. I must take my leave, everyone. Please have a phenomenal of the time. And don't worry about mucking up the place either. This train is state of the art and has systems for dealing with that. For everything else, please talk to Zell if you need anything. Don't just put me in a spot like that! <laughs> Sounds good! Absolutely! What the hell? Goodbye now! I like that guy. Thank you for following the outfit guide I sent you. You look a lot. You look amazing. I just wish I could read all your lore cards as well. Lore cards? That must be the details of information. I suppose it makes sense. Lore cards aren't read out loud. Otherwise, people would know murderers' intentions. Now on the nitty gritty for the murder mystery game. One of you will be murdered and the rest suspects. Everyone has assigned their roles for characters they will be playing. Participation is required for it is my birthday! Of course! Birthday girl makes the rules. Sonic, you are a ship captain and you'll be stationed in the conductor car. Naturally, that's where the captain would go. Tails, you are the detective. You'll be here in the dining car. Indubitably! He's great. Knuckles, you're the sheriff. Oh. oh, here. You're the sheriff. Around these parts, we'll find you in the saloon. Got it. Rouge, you're a business tycoon. And Blaze, you're a titan of the industry, both in the casino. What's the difference? There is none. Oh. <laughs> hmm, sounds fun. Hector? You're the butcher. Yes, you. You're the poet. Jesus. Stop that. Yeah, that makes more sense now. The butcher. Okay, that makes. Wait, if they had no idea what they, and they came dressed like this, how were they supposed to know what they'd be? <laughs> or did, or did Vector just not have any spare clothes and SBO just wanted to look fancy? Either one. Uh, both found in the library. Why is the butcher in the freaking library? Excuse me. What are they chopping up? Hear that, SBO? We can hang out together! And do what, Reed? Maybe we can make a tower of books or something? Shadow's a locksmith, hanging out in the lounge. <laughs> and last but not least, me, the journalist reporter! I'll be muzzing around with everyone! Did you get all that? Uh, yeah, I got all that. Now I was listening, okay? More than alright, you can help ensure everyone's following their roles. Oh, that reminds me. Look at map, look at map. I'll have a map for you. Everyone's station is marked on this map as well. How convenient. Map added to your inventory. Nice. The rules of the game are as follows. There is a murderer amongst you all. The murderer can kill a single participant. However, they cho choose. You must physically be present with the victim for it to count. Everyone else must collect evidence throughout the train and use it to interrogate, interrogate fellow passengers to figure out who done it. The murderer will lie about being accused, inspect everything you can, find clues, and interrogate. I'll set a timer for one hour so everyone can mingle and the murderer can do their thing. Is everyone ready? Sounds like it. Sounds like everyone's excited. Everyone, to your stations. Oh, this is nice. Oh.
It's got creepy. Oh. Ah, it's so exciting. My tree is a floating red and red and houses. How thrilling, I have goosebumps. Save us, this is awesome. Shouldn't you be out there mingling with everyone? Well, actually, I, I'm the detective. The detective and journalist can't be the murderer. So we're stuck here for an hour before going out and scoping the place. Scoping the place. <laughs> this way, there's always a neutral party. Makes sense to me. Seems as though Amy's more excited about this, about disappearing or mysteries anyway. I don't know what that word was. What do you think everyone's doing? Oh, probably inspecting their stations, talking amongst one another. Everyone has roles to play. They must be exploring the characters. Do you know what their character motivations are, Amy? No, the lore cards are con confidential. No one knows but the person who received them. Ah, it's, it's a flicky! My backstory is that I was best friends with a flicky that decided to join the evil Dr. Eggman, kickstarting my desire for justice in the world! My lore is that I'm a nosy person turned journalist. Not gonna lie, this kind of sounds fun. Wish I wasn't stuck on microwave duty. Question mark? The train started, started moving! It's going so fast! I wanted something! What's going on? Oh, I'm sleeping! Hold on! I can't! Ah! Ah! No! Who died? Did we crash? Wait, what? I heard rumble. Did you all hear that? Nope, we crashed. Ooh. Okay. Tails! You're both awake! Oh, Amy. You're both awake! Y yeah. It seems like the train has slowed down considerably. Uh, is everyone alright? Yeah, my head's spinning a bit, but I'm okay. My buddy! It seems we've been knocked into the, the diner's car's closet. This train reached some incredible speeds. We're getting our money's worth with this experience, that's for sure. Is this actually intended? Is it, it's my first day, so I'm not really sure. I don't recall warning me about this interview. We should go check on the others. Zell, could you get the door? Of course. Oh. Hmm, it seems the door's blocked, and I don't think it's budging. Amy, give that fa- Amy, give that fallen shelf a whack with your pico pico hammer! Mmm. What? Let's find another way out. Uh, I'll, I'll start looking for clues. I'll search over there. I know Amy, she's hiding something. Huh? Huh? I suppose she did wake up before us. Something could have happened. Listen, I know the detective here, but all the best detectives have sidekicks. I'm gonna need your help. Yes! I get to hang out with Tails the entire time. Let's gather clues on why Amy's acting this way and interrogate her about it. Nice, buddy! Check out everything. You can around the closet, then we'll show it to Amy and uncover the situation. Gather evidence and interrogate it. Got it. Gather evidence and interrogate Oh. Understood. Yo, wait, what? Okay. You can count on me, Tails. I won't turn evil like your ex flicky companion did. Happy to hear it. Now let's get searching. Alright, now let's save. Fuck. Dining closet. It's May 4th. I didn't know that, actually. I forgot what day it was. Uh, resume. Let me check something real quick. Going hmm. All right. Let's uh just bonk this volume down really far. All right, guys. So this is gonna be part one of our the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. We just got into it. We but we've been uh here for about thirty minutes doing this stuff. Uh, to, um, you're gonna get new episodes of this soon but uh oh okay one second ah i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry don't don't do anything far okay 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 understood understood i'll, I'll check i'll do all this stuff tomorrow um <laughs> all right so y'all i would just like to say well thank you for supporting me on youtube new series starting y'all get excited all right i'll see you all in the next episode of this and Please like, subscribe, share, notifications. Let's go. New series. Get hype. Get hype. Get hype. All right, y'all. See ya.
hope you enjoy more series like this. We'll do Undertale eventually on this channel because I really want to. All right, see ya.